going on, guys? It's your boy, Miles Cunningham. Uh, shout out to Lucario. Shout out to all the supporters. Shout out to everybody that is on that Bad Boy membership. Uh, shout out to everybody that got the Game Kings documentary. Remember, if you get on the Bad Boy membership, you can also stream the Game Kings documentary as a part of the Bad Boy membership, right? We got over 90 different programs. We also have many of our seminars on there. And I'm going to let Mr. Lucario talk a little bit more about the value and importance of the bad boy membership. The bad boy membership is for guys at various levels of the game. You can be a guy who has never talked to a woman or you could be a guy who is just trying to improve his game. Either way, these easy to follow steps in the bad boy membership program will help you become the man who will attract beautiful women. I've helped thousands of men achieve success in the dating game and I want to help you achieve that same success. Remember, in order to attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women, there's really just one thing you need to do. Examine and practice the game on a consistent basis and what better way to do that than to join the Bad Boy Membership Program. So in the Bad Boy Membership, you get a different 45 through 90 minute audio slash video series every month filled with detailed easy to follow step-by-step -step content that will help you attract beautiful women and unlimited email coaching a $49.97 value you get for free you get all of this for only $97 a month and remember you can cancel anytime don't miss out on this opportunity click below and join the bad boy membership today today what I want to talk about um, real quick is <clears throat> different levels of a conversation and social intelligence right there's different levels to conversing you know there's different levels like you know when we're out here cold approaching or meeting and interacting with chicks and or meeting and interacting with people in general there are different levels of, of conversation and there's different levels of intelligence within that conversation right so I just want to talk about that and I want you the reason I want to talk about it is so you can understand where you're at you understand you can understand that um you know because a lot of guys they'll go out and they will um they'll talk to chicks and they might you know chicks might ignore them chicks might reject them or whatever whatever and they can't understand why these things are happening and what and, and the big part of it is that there's a lack of you know there's a lack of social intelligence when you're interacting with women when you're speaking with women when you're you know doing your thing you understand what i'm saying um so i want to talk about that right so the first you know the first level of conversation and in you know uh, verbal interaction is the nervousness and what i would call the unconscious level you understand nervous and unconscious meaning that you're not actually in the conversation. You're actually more concerned about how you look. You're more concerned about what to say next. You're more concerned about just trying to keep the conversation going, right? But in this in this phase of the conversation, uh, you're not even hearing what the girl is saying. Like you're you, you're hearing it conscious. You know, you're hearing it consciously because you have hearing. You have a, a functioning ears but you're not actually hearing what she's saying you're not really listening you're literally just trying to keep the conversation going so that's why you have a lot of guys when they're when they're very young in the game they'll get into um situations where they're just asking questions to get to the next like part of the conversation you know what i'm saying oh you know where are you from what do you do da, da, da. like it's like that robotic type of um conversation that guys get into with women and what happens is and what happens is is that you're really you're you're really unconscious you understand you're not you're not actually there because you're you're like i said you're nervous and you're more focused about simply keeping her in front of you you're 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 nervous and you're and you're focused on well i need to keep the conversation going so i can keep her attention right but that's all you're really doing you're just trying to keep her attention and keep the conversation going and that's a part of the progress that's a part of the progress of understanding who you are within the game and understanding where you're at you understand and if that's where you are at this point in the game what you need is more practice you understand what you need is more practice that's why we encourage you guys to get on the bad boy membership we have a, we have programs about um uh converse the art of conversation the art of flirting you know just 
you know, the art of approach. You understand what I'm saying? Like we have different programs on there that really talk about this stuff in depth and give you, you know, things that you can say, ideas about, you know, ways to get your confidence up so you can elevate out of this uh, phase of conversing and interacting with females. You understand what I'm saying? So that's the first phase, right? It's just nervous and unconscious and you're literally just trying to keep the conversation going, but you're not actually interacting in the conversation you understand you just have a you just have a list of questions in your mind that you ask and you continue to ask them just to keep the conversation going you understand what i'm saying but you're not actually really there in the conversation mentally it's just a, it's just a triggered response to having a girl standing in front of you or sitting in front of you so you can converse and and, and have a conversation going right so now there's number phase number two of the you know the conversation and social intelligence phase um or paradigm or whatever is the conscious the conscious phase right you're actually conscious like you you've gained a level of confidence where you're past the um the phase of you, you're not i mean you're still a little bit nervous because you're meeting someone new and so on and so forth but you're not like that's not what you're focused on you're not focused on being nervous now you're 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 focused on you're keeping the conversation going right and you're hearing what she's saying, you understand? So now you, you take what she says and you can actually respond to it and continue the, the conversation um, in that way where it's, you're a little bit more relaxed, you're, you're a little bit more, um, you're present, right? Cause you're actually conscious and you're less nervous and you're, you know, the conversation is going, um, but you know, it's, you still have a little bit left to be desired because you're not, you know, active you're not completely active within the conversation like you're active and you're conscious but you're not you're not really influencing the conversation you're just kind of seeing where the conversation goes and you're responding maybe maybe you might be able to um stumble upon saying something funny and you'll get a laugh or you know maybe uh in in situations like that usually it's the it's if the woman is um interested in you she'll be the one that's actually controlling the conversation you understand and and you'll you'll just really be there responding to you know her questions and so on and so forth but the conversation usually is decent you understand the conversation is decent everything is going well you know um and it it's going <laughs> you understand what i'm saying like you know somebody actually how's it going you'd be like hey it's going you know there's, there's nothing exactly good and there's nothing exactly bad, but it's right there in the middle and it's going, right? So you're conscious and you you know how to you know how to keep the conversation going. And it you 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 you've actually elevated past small talk as well, right? Because you're not just asking those that that robotic list of questions, but you're actually getting into different things, right? You know, maybe maybe you're 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 paying attention to the environment and you're actually asking questions about the environment and making the trying to make the conversation a little bit more interesting in that way, you know what I'm saying? But it's really just like I said it's just the conversation is going but it but it's not really leading anywhere based on your direction it's just actually going you understand and that's that's a cool place to be but you still need more practice right you still need more information right you still need to study more you still need to uh you know there's another level that you can get to that you would rather be you understand and again you can get get to that type of level by getting on a bad boy membership all right or at least you know reading doing more research on conversations and things like that now when it comes to being a man it's about being that rock it's about being stable so first you're gonna have to find discipline within yourself do you have that type of discipline do you even have the heart to be ruthless to women you? need leadership it is in their nature to seek out leadership you know you can't do a 99 because all that's part of a man. You gotta do it 100. Apparently, these women out here having sex with somebody. Apparently, they're getting pregnant with somebody. <laughs> Shoot, somebody getting some. You should look at something like hypergamy and allow it to inspire you to always be evolving, getting better, expanding, developing. There are things you know, there are things you don't know. Then there are things you don't know you don't even know. There can be 10 of us in one room, and there's one question, and there's 10 correct answers, all different. Level three, right? Level 
three is not just consciousness, but awareness. Now you are at a space where you are aware of your own presence within the conversation. Now you're actually um, using the inf you're listening to the to the female and you're using the information that she's giving you, right? To not just keep the conversation going, but but to get it to go in a direction that you want it to go into. You understand what I'm saying? That's the third level. And that's the level that you really want to be at. And that's the level that comes with, you know, research, practice, um, practical application, and, and constantly, you know, uh, practicing your social skills, your social interactions, and so on and so forth. That's where you really want to be. You understand? And if you're not there, like, again, again, I know it sounds like a shameless plug, but if you're not getting on the bad boy membership, you at least need to be getting on something. You understand? Like, shout out to all the rest of my guys. You know, uh, the man mindset, manhood is a skill set, Mr. 1950, um, um, silverback lifestyle, uh, Coach EO championship game. You understand what I'm saying? Um, K Zagan, you know what I'm saying? Check out the, the our show, um, Real Game No Theory, you know, every Sunday at 6 p.m. Eastern. I'm actually doing this video right now, getting ready for that show. <clears throat> but yeah, this is where you want to be. You want to be at the third level. This level is the awareness level. You understand? You understand where you're at. You're not, and you're not really, you're not really nervous anymore because the only, at this point, the only time you're ever like nervous is the initial approach where you say, what's up? And you, and you have no idea if she's going to be receptive or not. So you still have that little bit of nervousness, but you're not, but once you start talking, that goes out the window because you know you're, you're talking and she's being receptive she's once she's being receptive we're good there's no more nervousness we're not worried about that anymore what we're focused on now is being aware now you can actually influence the direction of the conversation by listening to her and not only listening to her words but listening to her body language because here's the thing here's here's something that's very important that a lot of guys overlook when you ask a, a woman a certain question She'll give you a she'll give you an answer, right? But there will be times that she'll talk about a certain topic and you'll see her face light up. Or you'll see her smile just a little bit more. Or you'll see her get a little bit more excited when she starts talking about whatever whatever that is. So let's just say you ask her about her family. You understand? And and let's just say, you know, she just got a nephew, right? Maybe maybe she had a sister or brother that just had a kid. And so so now she's super excited about having a nephew and she's oh yeah you know my family's awesome my sister just gave me a nephew and and they're so cute and i just love them and da, 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 da. now a guy like me i got a nephew too right so when i see her talking about her nephew and getting excited and getting happy i'll start talking about my nephew and i might pull out my phone and show her pictures of my nephew and that and what that'll do is that will connect us you understand that will that will allow us to begin to bond you understand and um so you're listening to her and you're, and you're using those things that that can bring that can create a bond that then can um then you can maneuver use the use the use the, all of that information use the bonding use everything that you've recorded like i said not just her verbals but her body language her her elevation of mood and all of those different things right because here's the thing with um awareness awareness allows you to do multiple things at once. Awareness allows you to talk. Yeah, you could talk, you could ask questions and whatever, whatever, but now you're actually recording information. Now you're like the Terminator where you see everything. You understand? You're not just hearing her words, so you can, because a lot of times when people are in the um, consciousness or the nervousness, unconscious part of the conversation, they're, lit they're literally just, they're hearing, but they're just literally listening to hear the other person stop talking so they can ask the next question. You get what I'm saying? They're not really having a conversation. They're just waiting to hear a break in the in the in sound so they can interject and start asking their next question. Again, because they're nervous, because they're not actually there. But when you when you are aware, when you are aware and conscious in a conversation, when you're at the third level of conversing and having social intel in, you know, intelligence and social, you know, being um, thorough in your social interactions, that's when you begin to record. You begin to see different things. That's when you, you know, after you reach this level, that's when the game becomes just a little bit easier, right? Because now 
you you're also putting out your body language right because you as you talk to her as you bond with her now you're you're moving closer because like for example i said to you that um if she has a nephew i have a nephew and i'm gonna take out my phone to show her a picture now i'm not just gonna take my phone out and um i'm i'm not just gonna take my phone out and hand her my phone and show the, show the pictures of my nephew no i'm gonna move closer to her put my arm around her and show her the pictures on my phone of my nephew you understand so now we'll be in closer proximity so i'm doing multiple things i'm talking i'm relating i'm bonding and i am bringing i'm i'm, I'm changing the dynamics of body language and proximity you understand i'm getting closer to her i'm showing her that i'm you know that i'm feeling her that i'm that i'm willing to get into her space and because we're bonding more than likely she'll allow me to get into her space you understand what i'm saying so i'm doing multiple things at once once i have awareness of the conversation right so now i'm seeing how she's responding to me getting closer how she's responding to everything about me because i might have on cologne i might be dressed real nice so she <clears throat> so after we finish looking at pictures of my nephew i'm not gonna move away i'm gonna stay there you understand what i'm saying and then i'm gonna you know if if, if you know maybe she was touching my phone and and her you know her fingers are, are on the phone and i noticed that she has a, a manicure or her fingers look really nice or her hands are really soft and now i put the phone down and i'll start touching the hands and talking about how soft their hands are you understand what i'm saying and then i start getting into more of bringing the conversation around to where i want it to get to why because i'm aware I'm not nervous anymore. I'm not just asking questions just for the sake of asking questions. I'm actually directing, I'm directing the conversation. You understand what I'm saying? I'm directing the conversation. I'm moving the conversation from small talk to bonding to now I'm getting into her personal space and into her, her personal frame of mind where I can start to impart the fact that I'm attracted to her. You understand? The fact that, you know, I definitely want to see her again or the fact that, hey, what are you doing right now? Let's, you know, let's go do something. You understand? Like, you know, I'm, you know, let's go do something casual. Let's go, you know, let's go hook up. Let's go do whatever. You understand what I'm saying? I'm, I'm starting to, you know, even, even maybe move in for the kiss or whatever. You understand what I'm saying? But the point I'm trying to make is that with a you you own you can only unless you're just lucky because you you got a lot of cats out here macking by accident you understand and shout out to y'all dudes that are macking by accident but for the most part most guys you know you have to get to that level of awareness where you it's beyond being nervous it's beyond being you know uh just robotic with the small talk questions and answers but now you're actually controlling the conversation you're actually using your mouthpiece to influence what she what she um what she's getting out of the conversation you understand not to necessarily influence her but to influence what she's getting out of the conversation you understand and then that can lead to seduction that can lead to you making an offer you understand making an offer of intimacy or being vulnerable with you you understand and if she has bonded with you and she's comfortable and she's enjoying her experience with you it's easier for her to get to the point where she's submitting and she's saying yes you understand because the in, the entirety of your you know of your direction of your maneuvering with the conversation has brought her to the point where she has she has no other you know she has no other reason but to say yes to you you get what i'm saying because she's enjoying herself she's having fun and you are the you are the architect of the conversation you are the director of the conversation and you brought it to that point and not only did you bring it to that point but she trust me she she realized that she noticed that you brought it to that point and she can she and she continued to stay there like i said when you moved in closer when you put your arm around her when you're talking to her a little bit closer when you when you're saying things that are a little bit more personal you understand now if you <clears throat> sometimes it doesn't work perfectly sometimes she'll back up sometimes she'll move away sometimes you say hey you're getting too close or whatever whatever now it, that's up to you to assess again you have to assess and you can't be afraid to understand hey maybe she's not feeling me like that maybe the conversation didn't go as well as i thought or maybe it did but maybe she's still not ready for that intimacy part yet at that point that's when you can just be like hey you know i think you're really cool i want to um get to know you on a more intimate level you take my number you give me a call anytime after 7 30 anytime after eight o'clock you understand either tonight or tomorrow you understand or, or you know whenever you feel like you're ready right and then you keep it moving you understand but the point is you have a certain level of awareness 
And with that awareness comes confidence. And with confidence comes your ability to uh, direct the conversation, you understand? And direct the conversation through body language, through what you what you see, what you hear, and what you feel. Because there's a, there's energy within this as well. And, and that's another level of awareness. When you when you have awareness, you 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 know you get to record her words, her actions, her body language, <clears throat> her tone of voice, and her energy. You understand what I'm saying? All these things start to start to make sense to you. You understand? All these things start to make sense. Why? Because you're not nervous and you're not focused on just one thing, which is to keep the conversation going. You're actually able to focus on multiple things. You're actually able to do, you know, to accomplish multiple things within the conversation. And that's that's why you need to get to that third level. That's why you need to practice. That's why you need to. Because here's the thing. <clears throat> A lot of guys, you know, um, you know, they're not really fans of cold approach and all of this and all of that. But. What do you think you're doing when you're spending time with a chick that already likes you? You understand what I'm saying? Like you're still having conversations. You're still giving her an experience of you. You understand? You still have to understand the dynamics of doing these things. Yes, because there's there's different levels to all types of conversation. Even after you've broken the ice, even after you even had sex with the girl, there's still rapport building. There's still a bond that is being built as you continue to see a woman, as you continue to relate to a woman, as you continue to, you know, create, you know, a bond or a story between you and her. You understand what I'm saying? So don't, don't think cold approach is, is a waste of time. Like it, it actually puts you in <clears throat> multiple positions that'll help you in the long run. You understand what I'm saying? In many different situations with women as far as relating to them and, and conversing with them and, and providing a certain experience and showing her the type of quality of man that you are. You understand? Based on your ability to relate on a social level. You understand? So take these things seriously. So I'm going to just go through it again. So we got the um, the first level is the unconscious nervous level where you're just you're just spitting out questions to keep the conversation going and you have no idea what you're really doing. The second level is consciousness, where you're conscious and you're, you know, you have a back and forth and you can respond, but you still are not actually influencing the conversation. And then you have level three, which is awareness. Awareness allows you to record all types of information that allows you to use that information to help you to maneuver, negotiate, and influence the direction of the conversation to where you want it to go so you can provide a dynamic experience for that female so she'll realize that hey this guy that i'm talking to right now is different than any, any other guy that i've ever met and i would like to continue this and that's where you're trying to get to all right and like i said i suggest if you you know i suggest you get on the bad boy membership but if you don't want to do that you got to get some research done about conversations and about relating to people on the social on a social basis or you just got to practice you just gotta practice. You gotta put yourself in the situation again and again and again so you can gain experience points and learn. And so you can start to see the patterns, right? Because once you keep doing this stuff again and again and again, the nervousness will go away. And once the nervousness goes away, now you can focus on becoming conscious. Now, once the nervousness goes away and, and you're conscious and you're comfortable being conscious, now you can focus on awareness. And then once you're aware, now you can begin to be a badass when it comes to dealing with these chicks, because that's when you can start to actually influence and um, maneuver and direct the conversation to where you're trying to get it to go. And then that's when, after you after you get awareness, that's when you can start to get to seduction. And then that's when, that's when you'll really get to where you really wanna be, all right? So appreciate you guys for hanging out with me. Appreciate you guys for checking out the video all the way to the end. Really appreciate you guys. Remember to like the video, share the video, and subscribe to this channel. And please comment as well, man. If you if you want to add something to what I'm talking about, or you know, if you want to suggest something for another video, please. I really appreciate you guys. You know, a lot of guys took some time to um, give me some suggestions, and you know, I, I got to a few of them, and I actually answered a few of them with other videos that I actually did. So I really, you know, shout out to you guys that are getting in the comments and really. Um, you know, suggesting different topics that you want to hear. Really appreciate you. All right. So, um, oh, and remember the bad boy membership, the Game Kings documentary. Um, go to mrlucario.com, go to badboymembership.com, 
we have uh, t-shirts on Teespring, and we also have the 60-minute consultation with your truly. You understand? Just check all the links, man. Everything is there. So really appreciate you. I hope you're having a great day, and remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. Now, before you go, click the link below and go to badboymembership.com. Now, badboymembership.com is a place where you go to get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Listen, I know you're tired of being rejected. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of being afraid to approach women. Go to badboymembership.com. I know you're tired of not getting the women that you want. Go to badboymembership.com. Listen, I know you're tired of being alone on a Friday night. Go to badboymembership.com. Now picture this. You'll go from not getting what you want when it comes to you dealing with women to actually getting what you want, to being the guy women want to be with, women want to date, women want to have sex with. All you need to do is go to badboymembership.com, follow the steps, learn the game, implement the game, and then you will get the woman you want. Make sure you go to badboymembership.com today. Click the link below. What's going on? It's your boy, Miles Cunningham. And what I want to talk about today is the Bad Boy Membership Contest. All you have to do to be eligible to win the Bad Boy Membership Contest is to be a Bad Boy member. See, what we realize is that when guys join the Bad Boy Membership, they make the transition from simp to player very quickly. And we're just trying to make that transition just a little bit easier. So here's what you get if you win the Bad Boy Membership Contest. So here's what you receive if you win the Bad Boy Membership Contest. A bottle of Bad Boy Cologne by Carolina Herrera, New York. A luxury designer timepiece. And a $100 gift card. To increase your chances of winning, share this post in your story, tag three friends, and subscribe to Mr. Lucario or the Miles Cunningham YouTube channel. The link is in the bio. And follow real mr lucario and miles in the game on instagram the winner will be announced at the first of the month good luck